Hey, welcome back. It's good to see you again. Today we're going to continue on electricity and we're going to talk about parallel and series connection. Okay, so in an electric circuit, there are different components and then we join them using wires. So there are two ways that we can join things together. All right, the two ways are joining them in a parallel fashion and in a series fashion. So let's talk about parallel first. Parallel means that the components are connected by nodes. Okay, all right. Okay, let me illustrate this. So if I have three resistors here, A, B, and C. Okay, all right. The first resistor is connected to the second resistor like this. Right, and the third resistor, okay. Okay, right. So you see, for A to go to B, all right, it has to go via a node, all right? Or maybe you can think it like an interchange. For example, you can think of A, resistor A, maybe it's the MRT station, Somerset. Somerset is on the north south line, all right? And then B maybe is a station, Little India. Little India is not on the north-south line, it's on the northeast line, all right? And then C, you have Bras Basa, which is on the circle line. All three stations are connected at Dolby God. So Dolby God is the node, okay? So they are on different pathways. The way you connect them is via a node, okay? Compare it with a series connection, and then you will be clearer. Series connections are connected directly all right okay so if i have resistor a b and c there is only one pathway or one wire that is passing through all of them so this is like three stations maybe on the east west line you have bugis lavender and then you have kalang all right one straight after another so this is series this is parallel all right okay let me illustrate the concept through a few work examples okay first over here that's A, B, and C again, all right? Okay, so let's think about each of them. So let's look at over here. So A and B, are they connected in series or parallel? Can A reach B directly without passing through a node or an interchange? Yes, okay? So A and B, they are in series, okay? So we see this whole thing as one group. So the group A and B, now with C. How are they connected? This whole thing to go to C, oh, see, there is a node here, there is a junction, all right? So this group A and B and C is parallel connection, all right? Let's have another example, A, B, and C again, all right? So you see there is like a grouping over here, so we try to solve this part first. So group, so no, I just write B and C, all right? So from B to C, you see there is a node here. All right, similarly, okay? So B and C, they are connected in a parallel fashion. So this one group already. So group B and C with A, all right? This whole thing and A. So it goes straight to A. They are in series, okay? All right? See the difference, all right? When it needs to go through a junction on a node, then the components are connected in a parallel fashion. If you can go directly, just like stations on one train route, then it is series. Last example, let's say I have four resistors here and then I have like a funky looking connection that looks like this. I have a band, then I have like a branch over here, all right? Okay, so look at this diagram. Where are the nodes? Is this a node? All right, is this a node? Okay, one and two, all right? Two is a node because there's a branch off, you see? It splits. One is not a node, it's just, I just draw the wire just like this. It's still one single path, all right? There's no splitting of tracks on, on a train or in a branch, okay? So the electricity, the current don't have to split, okay? So A, B, C, D, all right? So we look at A and B first, these two. Right, so A and B, they are connected in series or parallel, you tell me. Can it go directly to each other? Without any nodes? Yes, so it is series. How about C and D? Right, see? 
There are no nodes here. It's just a band, so it's in series. But this whole group and this whole group, all right, the blue group and the pink group, so group A and B with group C and D, all right, they have to pass through, you see, the nodes here or here. So their connection is in parallel, all right? So I hope you get this concept correctly, okay? So there are two ways that we can join components in a circuit together, either through parallel or through series. Parallel means that they pass through like a branch, a node, an interchange, like Adobe got split, okay? Series, they are on the same route, same pathway, all right? Have this foundation right, and then the next lesson, we will build on this concept. See you then.